fucking thing works. Let me see who I can add on here. Just gonna go ape shit, see who jumps on. Those wet shimmy guys. Um. Do you guys see me? Um, I'm just tagging people in the video. I haven't done this in a while, so forgive me, guys. All right, let's see who's on. All right, all right. Tony, Samuel, what's going on, guys? What's going on? Yeah, I haven't done one of these in a while, guys, so forgive me. Um, so, uh, Alex, what's going on, brother? El Chingon, Marcos, que onda loco? All right. Um, nothing much, bro. Just gonna do a, um, live shave because YouTube is acting a fucking fool right now. I've got over a thousand subs. Um, it's been a week. They're saying it takes 24 hours to do a video. Um, yeah, nothing much. Um, carry on. Just uh, trying to do a video here. Because um, YouTube doesn't allow me to do a um, live. I don't know what the hell's going on. I mean, all the requirements. Um, nothing's blocked. I have no nothing against me. Because um, if you have, like, say, for an example, if you, if you break certain rules... Uh, you're on probation for like, I don't know, um, like 30 days, 90 days or something like say for a copyright or what have you. Um, I have nothing on my, on my, uh, YouTube record. Um, so, uh, I was on the phone just a few minutes ago with a couple of guys, um, Tony and Alex and decided, you know what? Fuck it. Let's do a video. I got some new, um, soap in the den. So this will probably be uploaded on my YouTube channel. Soap Cal Shave. Um, and we're gonna go in with, I know everything's backwards here, but this is awesome sauce from PAA. Um, yeah, I know it's fucking crazy, man, it sucks. Uh, so I'm gonna go in with this here. This is the coke and butter formula. Um, so when it is uploaded, it's gonna be in the upright position instead of um, um, widescreen. So it is a brand new puck. I was waiting to use this on a live, but fucking YouTube, dude, I'm, I'm not allowed you. I'm I'm pretty I'm pretty fucking pissed. Um, it took a long time to finally get here. Now that I'm here, um, YouTube's just acting like they're fucking new, dude. Uh, pissing me off. Um, been going with the matching aftershave splash here. Um, yeah. Okay. So the scent is an identical for me. It's an identical match to this here. That's what the scent is, is supposed to be marketed after. It's a dupe of uh, Parasol Green, the aftershave not the soap, the aftershave, not the soap, okay? Um, for those of you guys, I don't have the soap on me right now. It's, some, it's, it's in my uh, in my cabinet. Hey, what's going on, Mike? What's going on, brother? Um, sh I try not to buy any soaps, Mike. I tried, but uh, there's some stuff that I must get when I see it. And uh, this here, the awesome sauce was one that I had to get. But uh, yeah, so... Um, for those of you guys who uh, use or have used a Parasol aftershave and the actual soap or the cream, um, the scents have uh, um, they have a similarity, but the aftershave splash itself itself uh, has a different scent um, in a way, if you will. Um, but it's hard to explain what I'm talking about unless you use them both. But uh, those of you guys who love this aftershave splash know what I'm talking about. It's fucking awesome. And this soap smells identical to the aftershave splash. So I have not used it. Um, you can see it's still got the uh, lid on there. So we're going to actually pull that off right here right now. Um, and uh, like I said, I haven't. There you go. I haven't used it yet. Um, I've been waiting. 
to do it with this video for the live, but that's not gonna happen. So that is that. Um, I also got this uh, sample here, like I mentioned to the guys. Um, I didn't want to sanitize it to get the cardboard all messed up, so I will have to wash my hands directly right after I show you guys this. But this is a, um, if you guys can see that, it's called uh, Dive, what? Dive, Diver Down. It's a scent that's coming soon from Phoenix. Um, so I haven't sanitized this yet. Um, so I'll have to wash my hands right after this. Um, so that's what I got in my package. DK, what's going on, brother? 326. Thanks, brother. Thank you. Uh, and the razor I'll be using today because I want to test something out will be the raw razor with the lubricating strips. I know the video quality is really bad because I'm using the front facing camera. The Instagram video um, quality is not that great. And uh, the reason why I'm using that is because I want to see if it can bring the best out on the Astro Blade. And my brush of choice will be my 30 millimeter um, Grizzly Bay retro brush there. So I'm um, gonna go ahead and pull out a blade here. Gonna use a brand new blade right out of the packet. There you have it. And uh, forgive me if I do miss any comments, guys. I'm not being rude. Um, the comments probably just got away from me. So let's get into it here. I'm not really used to doing Instagram videos, so forgive me on that front as well. Yeah, so I hope you guys are all well and doing great. Yes, sir, Grizzly Bay. Grizzly Bay. And the first time I used this razor, oh boy, it put the whole, um, there you go, the whole gimmick razor shit to rest because, oh, what a phenomenal razor this was. Got poor connection, supposedly is what it says. Golden's and steel, what is, what's going on, brother? What's going on? So there we have it there. Gonna go ahead and start loading the puck. Man, oh man, I got poor connection supposedly. Hopefully you guys can see what's going on here. Yeah, I'm just gonna load the shit out of this tub. I wanted to use the Grizzly Bay today because uh, I'm still breaking in the Grizzly. Did I get anything for Persona Razors? Uh, no, Mike, I didn't. I haven't. No, I haven't. I heard I heard about uh, Persona sending some stuff out to some YouTubers, but no, I, I never I never got on that one. Yeah, to be honest with you guys, um, Tony and uh, Alex kind of um, inspired me to do this shit because we're just, I was telling them about how YouTube was acting stupid and uh, really wanted to shave. Um, I actually saved some of my beard, I take my beard girl three times in a row hoping to get a damn live done, but I got to get this shit off my face, man. You don't have to load a lot with Kokum. Or with any of Douglas's soap, but I always I load heavy on everything, especially since this um, this is this bore I'm still breaking in. Oh shit. I've got so much fucking soap. I can give two shits if I, <laughs> if I load light or heavy. I'd rather, lo I'd rather load heavy than anything. <clears throat> yeah. 
Yeah, I've got a lot on here. Man, it smells so good. Can you guys do me a favor? It keeps telling me that I got bored connection. How bad is the connection? Should I just stop and start in the other bathroom where it's closer to the Wi-Fi? Let me know and I'll, I'll move over to the other bathroom. Oh man, this stuff smells amazing. That stopped and starts, huh? All right, let me see if um, all right, um, you know what? Give, give me a second. Let me get everything uh into the other bathroom, and I'll keep it live like this, and I'll just transfer everything over so that way you guys don't miss anything. But uh, let me just transfer some stuff over, and I get over to the other bathroom. Hold on. Let me just grab all my shit over here, guys. Give me a second. I'm gonna do this shit on the fly. take the camera light off I know this sucks I'm sorry guys I really am gonna take you guys with me <laughs> we're gonna go for a little ride all right I'm gonna stand over here I'll be closer to the um, to the router I'm in my daughter's bathroom I'm gonna get the light on over here Let's see if we can get this shit working over here without nothing falling over, which is going to be a fucking pain in the ass, I believe. I'll have to go on the side here. All right, let's see if we can get that here. All right. You guys can see my daughter's background. <laughs> All right, so put the... um lighting over here let me go give me a second guys all right i'm back i gotta go get another light for this bulb here because um one of my daughter's lights went out all right, let's see. Uh, when is Manny so coming out? <laughs> All right, so I am closer to the other. Um, I'm in the other bathroom, so we'll see how this does here. So let me let me hydrate this uh, soap.
Let me know if this is um better, guys. What the shit? All right. So first pass with the grain. Let's see if we can bring the best out on this blade here. Again, we are going with an Astro blade in the raw razor with the lubricating strips. First pass with the grain. Holy moly. <laughs> um, wow. Okay. Um, I have no uh, pre-shave prep. Um, I just, I'm winging it right now. I'm not gonna lie with you guys. Uh, first pass that you just saw, by far the best. Uh, First strokes I've ever had with an Astro Blade. Fucking A. Wow. Mm-hmm. I am amazed. I'm trying to make sure I'm in focus. Sorry, guys. I totally forgot about that, guys. I am so sorry that um, the Instagram video is a bit different. So when I'm shaving, I'm shaving off camera by accident. Sorry. Wow. Um, and I have um, moving. Um, I mean, I'm on. Yes, sir, I am. Um, I've got um, a week's worth of growth now because I was waiting and waiting. The scent smells amazing. The menthol is amazing. The menthol is not strong. Not at all. Um, on a scale of one to 10, it's probably about, I've uh, been doing good brother. Uh, works pretty good. Work is good. Um, been having having some issues with our um, with our uh, with our permits and stuff. Gonna get in with some uh, beer here. I ran I ran out of the good stuff earlier. I was having some uh, uh, Palmer. If you guys know who that is, um, uh, Hefeweizen. I bought uh, two packs. I come in four tall cans. And then I had uh, bought a six pack of Whole Garden. So we're out of the good stuff. So I'm going to go in with the cheap shit here. Cheers. Uh, yeah, so we've been having some problems with our permits. But it uh, seems like everything's on track now. So can't wait to get the ball rolling again. How have you been, Marcos? 
I know we don't we don't keep in touch as much as we used to before. Um, and again, forgive me for that, brother. I've been really fucking busy, really, really busy. Um, Ed Otter, been shaving. What's going on, brother? Thanks for joining. Um, and I'm sure you've been pretty busy too, Marcos. Yeah, these lubricating strips are no joke. It is definitely not a gimmick. Cool, Marcos. It's been like that a, a bit lately with the whole community. I actually contacted um, um, Leroy the other day too, because you know he's been MIA. We haven't talked to him quite a bit. Just asked him if he was okay. You know, with this whole fucking COVID thing going on. You can't be too sure, you know? <clears throat> it hits all ages. Hey, what's going on, brother? <clears throat> so first and second pass. Excellent, excellent, excellent shave. I'm really glad that um, I'm doing this shave, man. I really needed a fucking shave. Just very irritated. You know, shit, man. Us as YouTube creators making content, you know. Um, before, um, before, you know, I'm not gonna lie. Those of you guys who do videos would understand. I didn't care about the numbers, but when we couldn't do live videos anymore and we needed a thousand subscribers, then it became about the numbers because I loved doing live shaves, interacting with my viewers, um, you know, is, is what I really enjoyed as well. And so now that we couldn't do go live, uh, we needed a thousand subs. Then it became about the numbers for me because um, I needed to get to a thousand to be able to go live. So, um, like I said, finally I was able to do um, to do a, a, a thousand, a, get to a thousand subs, and then not being able to go live, fucking hey, that irritated the shit out of me. I was like, how are we gonna fight to get to a certain point, and then you're gonna dog us like that, dude? You're gonna dick us around. Like I've told the guys before, I like to share all of my brand new experiences with you guys. 
or should I say, you know, because I'm so used to saying, you know, you guys or YouTube. Um, so when I got the soap, I was like, man, I can't. I'm so excited to share this with my viewers. And like I said, again, if that wasn't the case. Um, so I was actually going to do this video just for a few buddies of mine that were on the group chat with me. And I was like, you know what? Would you guys mind if I do this on Instagram? You know, so that way I can repost it. You know, and not not lose that first time experience, you know, reaction to the soap with the viewers and they were cool. They were cool with it, so that's cool. You know, I get to go live and I get to share with my viewers, so. Thank you, Tony and Alex for being cool with that. Wow, what a fucking awesome shave. I'm not lying, guys. If you guys can get this razor with the lubricating strips, the raw razor, R-A-W, with the lubricating strips, do not sleep on this razor. It, it truly is not a fucking gimmick, dude. It is an awesome, awesome razor. I saw some videos from some guys that, um, let's just say, aren't that experienced. Don't don't take it lightly. Um, don't over don't blow it out of proportion when you think, oh wow, this person is this famous and this that and the other. I almost didn't care for this razor if it wasn't because it was a gift for me. Um, but I didn't jump on the razor because of those videos. And now that I have the razor as a gift that was sent to me, I could have bought this razor when it first came out and gotten some extra lubricating strips. This razor is that fucking good. It is really, really good. I can't explain the experience that I'm getting from this um, without someone saying, well, you all you got to do is use a slicker soap or use pre-shave or, or this and that or use a different blade and you'll get the same results. No, 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 no. Use a razor. If you have someone who connect your ball with a razor, use a razor and then get back to me. Use a razor first. It's hard to explain. This is one of those razors where you really could get rid of all your razors in your den and you would be so happy and comfortable with this one razor. I missed a few comments there guys, sorry. Yeah, carry on. Um, I hear you, brother. I hear you. Yeah, the razor is effortless. Uh, carry on. Yeah, it is hard to um, be motivated, Mike. I hear you, brother. This is a stainless steel, golden steel. Uh, no, uh, Mike, I haven't heard anything from local gents. I don't think anyone has. The only person I think who, who's heard from him was, is um, is Marcos. Spencer, what's going on, bro? 
All right. Thanks for dropping on by, Spencer. I really do appreciate it. Michael. Is that Michael Riley who's in here? Yeah, Michael Riley is releasing um, uh, Dapper Man again. Um, uh, Alex. It's in his uh, new base. I did a clumsy move right here, and I think I, I think I nicked myself. I felt the blade. Wow, amazing. Okay, yeah, it is first line. <clears throat> yeah, I wouldn't doubt that they released it. Um, they, they sold out so fast. That's good stuff, man. Nice to see you on here, Michael. I'm sorry guys, I'm out of focus again. Shit, I keep forgetting. I'm so used to shaving wide angle, sorry guys. Alright. Let me rinse off guys.
Give me a second, guys. I forgot my alum black in the, in the my alum stick in the other room. Give me a minute. Yeah, uh, that's true, Golden Steel, because of the alcohol content. Or, because I'm sorry, because of the alcohol, because of um, COVID and everything. They needed to make uh, um, uh, hand sanitizers. Yeah, yeah, Barrister, man. Yeah, that's right, Alex. Oh yeah, that's right. So I forgot about that. Yeah, the soul man though, from a scale of one to ten, is probably about um, about a six. It's 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 there. It's noticeable. It's it's perfect for someone who wants menthol and likes menthol, and it's there. Uh, but if you're a menthol head and you're just like, oh man, I really want extreme menthol. It's not extreme. It's not extreme, but it is there. It, you know what? It's 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 just like parasol. It, I think it's just like parasol. It's got the same amount of um, um, cooling. So let me rinse this off, guys. freaking towel. I don't have my towel. All right, give me a minute. some awesome sauce man if you guys love parasol and I'm telling you this is a must-have I am a sucker for um <clears throat> for parasol green um, I was amongst oh man <sighs> that smells just like parasol green Oh man, he hit the nail right on the head with that one. I was amongst um, the group of people who wanted an aftershave that Parasol Green to last. Just like um, Club Mimpanad, um, and then he made the uh, Club Guy. Um, so, really, really good stuff, man. Really, really good stuff. Really, really dig it. I'm actually gonna put some on the arms here and me get some more. This stuff is so fucking good. <clears throat> Dry my face with the rabbit. <laughs> this stuff is so good. Oh, it's an identical match. It really is. Oh, amazing, amazing. All right, <clears throat> let's get into a recap, still got plenty of soap there in the brush. 
I'm gonna rinse this out, rinse out my knot. Just give it a quick rinse out. I'll rinse it out after the, um, rinse it out uh, better after the shave. Still got some soap in there, but it's all right. So, it <laughs> got leather everywhere. Our uh, shave of the day was with Awesome Sauce from PAA. And this was the uh, Coke and Butter formula. Perform amazing. Went in with the matching aftershave splash. Again, this is a uh, a dupe or homage, whatever you guys should choose to say, uh, to Parasso Green aftershave splash. Uh, went in with the Grizzly Bay Retro 30 millimeter bore uh, from Whip Dog. And went in with the raw razor with the lubricating strips and um let me go get the blades i forgot the blades guys sorry about that and these were the blades <laughs> that I went in with. But, um, man. So, um, again, um, these blades, uh, for me, weren't, um, aren't the best blades. Well, they're not, <laughs> they're not my favorite blades at all to use. Uh, but I was determined to find a razor that worked really well with them. And, uh, because I saw how well this razor worked the first time I used it, I said, you know what? I wonder if these lubricating strips are gonna pull the best out of that blade, and it did 110%. Really, really happy. Um, Gone Gone 1988, thanks for showing up, brother. I really appreciate it. Um, yeah, uh, take care, brother. I really appreciate it, Marcos. Uh, Astro SP worked well for me. Oh, that's what you were talking about, the SP or the SS, that's right. Uh, yeah, the SPs, uh, sorry about that, Golden Steel. Um, Astro will work well for me. Yeah, uh, nor, nor me. Um, I, I dig Persona, really, really good blades. So, yeah, um, it brought out the best in the blades. I'm really, really happy with that. Um, fantastic. Again, this razor is not a gimmick. Do not sleep on this razor if you see it on a BST. If you see someone or a friend selling it, jump on that shit and do not hesitate like I did. Because, damn, I'm so glad I got this razor. It is by far one of the best razors in my den um even more so than my uh rockwell 6s and and i've only used this razor three times um twice on camera one off and um i can say that it's that good it really is guys um so that is my shave guys thank you all for joining i really do appreciate it um again i will try to upload this video on youtube and hopefully I can get the comments on there as well. And uh, hopefully you guys can stay tuned and watch it or maybe uh, re uh, replay on YouTube. But that is it, guys. Hope you guys enjoy. Thanks for joining me. If you got like what you see, please like, favorite, share, and subscribe as always. And I will catch you guys on the next one. You guys stay safe out there. Later, guys.